Okay, we, we found what everyone is talking about, and that's these AK belt buckles, and Ricky Lamity is the president of the company. Ella V Golf. Ella V Golf that makes these things. Check it out, this is an actual AK Anthony Kim belt buckle, and right here Ricky's got the famous Ryder Cup belt buckle. That he wore the day that he beat Sergio. <laughs> I mean, this thing this is like one of the most popular pieces of uh, of, of golf memorabilia it's out there right now. Talk, talk about what you guys try to do for uh, for the tour players and and uh, coming up with these buckles and, and the clothing. Well, we uh, most of the players uh, like to be able to have pants that are made for them that fit them. You know, not an off the rack pant that they're trying to get to fit them. And uh, so the fact that we design the slacks and they can pick the exact fabric they want and uh, pick all the pockets and pleats and all that, they get to kind of create their own look. And uh, so it started that we really were doing slacks for all the players, and then we started getting into the belt buckles because we were making all these belt buckles for a lot of the professional athletes from all the other sports that they were wearing for fun. Okay. And then all of a sudden, uh, you know, we started doing the personalized ones and last summer, uh, we got together with Anthony Kim and we gave him the one with the AK that he wore in Washington when he won Tigers Tournament, the AT&T. And, um, and, and so it just so happened that that Thursday he got the buckle and on Sunday won the tournament. <laughs> and so he said it was his uh, good luck buckle. And, uh, and so... The rest is history. Well, the funny thing is we haven't even marketed the bell, but people through the internet have been trying to figure out where they can get it. So we get at least two to three emails uh, almost every day from people saying, where can I get that belt buckle? And, and nobody knew. And? And so they can go to elevee.com, E-L-E-V-E-E. -E -E. So you can actually <laughs> buy these belt buckles? Yeah, you can, uh, yeah, we can uh, personalize them with your initials. Okay. So, so I, I, I could go the red encrusted BT belt buckle on this? That's you right. need to put a little black on that too. A little black suit? But Red and black. There, there is a warning though. Okay. You gotta have some game when you play. <laughs> you tell me you can't, roll, you can't roll out to the first tee and shank it? <laughs> no, not, no, no shanking. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm thinking with, with my youths, you know, it's got a little red here for their great season, a little BT on there, we'd be rocking. We could rock that. You could put the double U's right in the middle of your, uh, your uh, put, initials. Put a little UU right up in yeah. there. Yeah, yeah. You know? Your football team went undefeated this year, so... That's right. You, know. you can put a 13-0 and 0 on there, too. It'll be a celebration. That's right. Okay, so everybody was probably going to want to know how much would a belt buckle like this cost? Uh, $395. $395. $395. That's not as bad as I thought it'd be. And it, and it comes with the straps and everything, so you can basically okay. put whatever straps you want with Ooh, it. Ooh, very nice. And so in addition to the buckle, you actually um, you know, have the straps that go with it. Oh, how about that? So it's not just a buckle, you got to try to figure out what to do with it. So are these... Are these all interchangeable so you can yeah. put different straps with the buckles? Yes. All right, very nice. Yeah. Now let's let's take a look at this other AK uh, black one here. All right, yeah, this is uh, one of the newer designs. And so this uh, is one we'll probably see coming up here. Yes, and um, I, why don't you pick it up and uh, tell me how flimsy it feels. Oh, yeah, flimsy. Yeah. <laughs> you know, if anyone tried to rush him, he could take this thing off and use it as a weapon. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> You know, so I'm thinking AK's probably got to have some abs work out. I don't even know if my back would hold this thing up for a minute. <laughs> you've, got, you've got a waist that will hold it up for Oh, you. thank you very much. I appreciate that. <laughs> that that's a knock on my uh, eating too much dessert last night. So that's pretty impressive. Well, we are at the PGA show, and it's been known, people have been known to drink and eat a fair amount down here. Yeah, that, that's, that's all part of it, right? <laughs> so in addition to the buckles, you said you make the pants. we got a buddy over here that, that you may recognize, Mike Weir good friend of ours. Tell us a little bit about what you do with Weirzy. Well, uh, Mike's been a, uh, he's probably the nicest guy on the whole entire tour. And um, we've uh, been doing his slacks for a couple of years. And uh, we, pr we have our own magazine because we have over uh, 2,500 professional athletes that we dress. So we put out our own lifestyle magazine. And so I asked Mike if he'd be interested in being one of the athletes that we profile in the magazine. And so he was nice enough to do a photo shoot with us in Utah. And uh, we got to see uh, Alta in the fall with the beautiful changing of the leaves. And I uh, got to go to his home. And as you can see here, this is probably the mantle that every golfer <laughs> aspires to, to have the Masters Trophy. 
right behind you. That's right. I mean, how much fun is that? That's right. It's, so it's not every day you get to stand in front of your Masters trophy. That's right. Bob, Bob's <laughs> dad won the 1970 Masters. So there you go. Uh, so he's been able to yeah, sit that's right. in front of a Masters trophy. That's yep. right. That's good. That's yep. pretty cool stuff. Yeah. So all this is available. You can check it out on your website, LV Golf, right? LV.com. All right, LV.com. Check it out and uh, look for... Uh, Look for this one coming up with uh, AK very soon. <laughs>